Do you often feel like there aren't enough hours in the day? It's a common struggle trying to juggle work, personal life, and everything in between. Effective time management can seem elusive, like a puzzle always missing one piece. That's where we come in. This video is your guide to solving that puzzle, as we delve into 10 habits that can transform the way you manage your time. Habits that can lead you to a more productive, less stressful life. Stay tuned to discover the habits that could revolutionize your time management. The first habit is prioritization. Now this is about recognizing the tasks that are most crucial to achieving your goals. It's about saying yes to the tasks that matter and no to those that don't. The benefits? You focus on what's important, avoid being overwhelmed and make effective use of your time. Next, we have time blocking. This involves allocating specific time slots for different tasks or activities throughout your day. It's like making an appointment with yourself to get things done. This way, you maintain a clear focus, minimize distractions, and increase efficiency. Lastly, let's delve into the Eisenhower Box Method. Named after the 34th President of the United States, it involves dividing tasks into four categories, urgent and important, important but not urgent, urgent but not important, and neither urgent nor important. By doing this, you can easily decide which tasks to do first, delegate, schedule, or even eliminate. These three habits alone could make a significant improvement in your productivity. Let's move on to the fourth habit, which is delegation. Delegation means assigning tasks to others when it's more efficient to do so. It's not about shirking responsibility, but about maximizing productivity. Remember, even the most capable among us can't do everything alone. The fifth habit is the Pomodoro Technique. This involves breaking your work into 25-minute intervals, separated by 5-minute breaks. These intervals are known as pomodoros. The idea is to maintain focus and productivity without burning yourself out. Finally, our sixth habit is the two-minute rule. If a task takes two minutes or less to complete, do it immediately. It's surprising how many tasks we put off that can be done in such a short time. Completing these tasks promptly prevents them from piling up and overwhelming you later. Adopting these habits can help you to make more efficient use of your time. Our seventh habit is the 80-20th rule, also known as the Pareto Principle. This principle suggests that 80% of your outcomes come from 20% of your efforts. In other words, focus on the tasks that yield the highest reward. It's about working smarter, not harder. Next, we venture into the world of single-tasking. In an era where multitasking is hailed as a skill, we encourage the opposite. Concentrating on one task at a time enhances productivity and reduces stress levels. It's time to redefine your definition of productivity by embracing single tasking. Our ninth habit introduces the five second rule. This rule is a simple yet effective tool for overcoming procrastination. If you have a task to do and it can be done in five seconds, do it immediately. This habit helps to clear small tasks that can otherwise pile up and become overwhelming. Lastly, let's talk about mindful breaks. This habit is all about taking regular, short breaks to recharge your mental energy. It's not about wasting time, but rather investing in your productivity. By allowing your mind to rest and refocus, you're setting yourself up for success in your next task. These four habits, when implemented, can significantly enhance your ability to manage your time effectively. To quickly recap, we've covered 10 habits that can improve your time management. Firstly, we looked at the importance of setting clear goals. This helps you understand what you're working towards, providing a roadmap to guide your daily tasks and decisions. Next, we discuss the practice of prioritizing tasks. By determining what's most important, you can ensure that your focus is where it needs to be. The third habit is about breaking down your tasks into manageable parts. This makes larger, more daunting tasks less overwhelming and more achievable. Moving on, we explored the habit of avoiding multitasking. It's about focusing on one task at a time to ensure quality and efficiency. The fifth habit is taking regular breaks. These moments of respite help to maintain high levels of productivity and reduce the risk of burnout. Next, we examine the importance of delegating tasks when possible. This not only lightens your workload but also allows others to grow and learn. The seventh habit is about utilizing tools and apps designed to enhance productivity. These can help you stay organized and on track. We then delved into the habit of setting deadlines for yourself. This creates a sense of urgency, helping to push you forward and keep procrastination at bay. The ninth habit involves maintaining a clean and organized workspace. 
This can significantly reduce distractions and increase efficiency. Lastly, we highlighted the habit of taking care of your physical and mental health. Remember, you're at your most productive when you're feeling your best. Each of these habits, when consistently applied and adapted to your personal circumstances, can significantly boost your time management skills. But it's not just about mastering these habits. It's about making them a part of your everyday life, making small but consistent improvements, and being patient with yourself through the process. Remember, effective time management is not about cramming as many tasks as possible into your day, but about simplifying how you work, doing things faster, and relieving stress. Start implementing these habits today and experience the difference for yourself.